Hey guys, today we have a mix fizz session where we'll be focusing on some repeat speed work over 80 meters, repeat speed work over 150, and then some aerobic 200s. So we're working on not just your, your long distance conditioning, but also your repeatability, um, making sure that you're able to bring high intensity efforts over a the course of, of the game. Obviously football's a long game, so we wanna make sure we're we're fit and able to repeat high intensity efforts in that second half and more importantly, the fourth quarter. So you can run our game strong. We've got low volume today as we're early on in the off season. So we, this is our first mixed fizz session. Um, so focus on quality, make sure that you're consistent with your, with your targets and your reps. And um, let's get into the warm up. So we'll start with a 10 minute um, feel good jog, build a pace that feels comfortable for you and that you can focus on your breath, uh, focus on your technique, and just get you mentally ready for the session ahead. Then from there, we've got uh, some dynamic movements, so some reverse lunges with rotation to focus on your core and stretch out the hip flexors, some hammy scoops, lengthen the hamstrings, arabesque to work on some foot, foot and hip stability, lateral lunge to get the groins ready, leg swings for some mobility, and tiptoe walks for some uh, calf activation. From there, we'll do five, five minute um, sprints, really focusing on your first step and first three steps, leaning forward. So getting that good 45 degree angle and making sure that we're uh, really strong with our arm swings. So that should get you well prepped for our first repeat speed block. Here we have 10 80 meter efforts and you go every 30 seconds. So have a stopwatch ready. You run a straight line, 80 meter effort, focusing on building towards 80% of your speed. So holding 80% of your speed for 80 meters. So for some of you, that's gonna be around 10, 12 seconds. Some might be 15 seconds, but as long as it feels like you're giving a hard effort, you're focusing on speed every effort, and then you rest for the time that's remaining on the 30 seconds. So if it takes 10 seconds, you get 20 seconds rest before the next effort. Every effort needs to be consistent. So try and hit the same speed. Then we'll have three minutes off to recover the legs and we'll hit a 150 meter effort. We've got two sets of four reps here and we're gonna alternate your intensity. So because we're still building our repeat speed conditioning, we don't wanna uh, go too hard too early. So we wanna get a 70% effort, which will have a prescribed time in there for you, um, which is gonna be uh, a pretty cruisy rep for you. It's gonna be moving at the average speed that you did for your 2K time trial. And then we're gonna have a rep for 120% of your average speed of your 2K time trial. All right, so make sure that you understand what your speeds are, what your targets are. You run 150 meter at a pretty easy effort, have your rest for 30 seconds, and then on the way back, should be a little bit faster. We do that four reps in total. So two reps at 100%, two reps at 120. They should feel like 70% for the easy rep and about 80% like the 80 meter efforts for the second rep. Then we're gonna have three minutes rest and you do that again. From there, we're, after you've finished that, we go straight into our 200 meter efforts. We've got two sets of four again, where we're focusing on not the, the time that you're running, but the rhythm of your run. So aerobic, we wanna be focusing on you breathing really well, uh, good short, quick steps, so your cadence is strong. Uh, and you should feel like you're in you're in the cruise, so you're able to maintain a good speed. You're not accelerating hard every rep. You're just focusing on rhythm, staying calm, and moving across the ground efficiently. That's today's session, guys. Like always, reach out if you have any questions on the Team Builder app. Cheers.